it was less media really than I wanted to work in advertising or marketing. So after university, um, I'd done some marketing courses as part of my degree and they were the most interesting to me. And I kind of fell into media whilst looking for wider roles in kind of the advertising industry. A little bit, so I, I did a maths and business management degree um, and it was the business management side of it that was more interesting, um, if I'm honest, like maths degree was pretty heavy. There's elements of that that covered marketing, advertising, they were the ones that um, kind of inspired me um, and I did a lot of courses through that about wider marketing strategy and, and that was why I chose this direction. So I joined Dentsu in 2011 um, and I had, I'd left university the year before, I was doing a, a job for a charity at the time in their publicity office um, and I was quite strenuously applying for a lot of jobs through different recruiters and I found um, Dentsu, I actually found a recruitment agency that were working for Dentsu at the time um, on a grad information board and applied through them. Um, and they sent me to a couple of agencies for, for interviews and it was, it was Dentsu that I got the furthest with but also um, wanted to work with the most. So I am Head of Planning at iProspect which is one of the media agencies here and um, that means that I look after all of the planning output for our, for our teams across the UK. So a lot of it is um, helping put the right processes in place, helping people find the information I'm also actively involved in, in quite a few clients where I lead the planning um, for, for those. So we have some, some fab clients in iProspect and I've got to work on quite a few businesses. But my team look after different elements and can do different parts of that. So uh, no day's the same, um, but um, essentially I am working to make sure that the media plans that we put together for all of the clients that we have through the iProspect agency are as good as they can be. I love the people, um, it seems like a, maybe a bit of a cop-out thing to say, but um, you get to meet so many different types of people working in an agency of this size, different clients, different people across the business units that we have within Dentsu, and you get to learn a lot from those people. So despite being here for 12 years, I still meet people, brand new people every day, and learn something different every day. So I joined entry level um, and I was, I wouldn't say I was shy, but I was a lot quieter. Um, I knew nothing about um, what I was doing. So I joined in the SEO team as kind of entry level, had never done any SEO before, didn't really even understand what it was when I kind of came here for my, for my first day. I've received a huge amount of training, particularly around the softer skills of, of leadership and management and how you work with people how you do things like this and, and talk openly and, and present and they've been the things that have been the most valuable to me and allowed me to kind of raise my hand and, and be a little bit more outspoken in the agency as well. It's the ones that take you out of your actual day job have been the ones that have been the most useful to me so things like presentation training, things like how to um, attack a brainstorm with completely different perspectives or bring different um, points of view together. So there's, there's a huge amount of training that's available to us through the agency, but also with some of our partners. So I've done training initiatives with Facebook and Google where they've kind of introduced you to their way of doing things, which have always bring, uh, bring a fresh perspective and have always been really interesting as well. I joined um, 11 years ago with very little experience and have moved through working in a single channel. So um, at iProspect we have all of the performance channel teams. Um, so I worked in SEO, um, which is organic search. And I was doing that for about three years and worked my way up to kind of account manager level and then took a um, move into doing multiple channels. So I went into digital strategy role, which was a fantastic opportunity. It allowed me to work on bigger clients and, and work on clients where I got experience and, and knowledge of broader channels, um, mainly just in the digital space at first, but then have kind of progressed as a, as a wider comms planner through that. And I'm now, I've kind of moved then around in some client roles as well. So the last couple of years, I've kind of gone from planner into managing partner and then back into head of planning, um, which I think has always given me um, 
a breadth of experience, but also kind of meeting different people, working in different spaces, different conversations, so that I have layered some of those capabilities on top of each other and can then work with different groups. I'd love, you know, I love working for our prospect. I think the next role when it comes will be a different step again, but at the moment I, I'm kind of very happily doing head of planning. And as I say, it, no day is the same, so I always feel like I'm learning and progressing anyway. Probably some of the challenges are the ones that have been challenges for everyone through Denso. We've, you know, we've had some structural changes, we've had agency um, mergers, so I kind of used to work for the old iProspect, which was just a performance agency, and, and three years ago we merged with another agency um, that was in the group, Visium, and created a, a kind of full service performance and comms agency. That meant having to work with new teams that had previously been very, very different to us and kind of um, work in different structures. We've also brought the UK offices much closer together, so um, less so big challenges, but kind of additional things to have to negotiate, new ways of working, kind of sounds really boring, but we've had different finance systems in all of those agencies and offices, so you've had to kind of spend more time almost relearning some of the basics um, to just get through, which has been interesting, but as I said, it's, it's brought more strength to everyone's ways of working at the moment because we've got bigger team um, and we've got more perspectives on the team. It's a, it's a fun place to work. Um, we are very people centric. Um, so we, um, as part of the kind of the Dentsu culture, we speak about having been good for people and being good for society and good for business. And that means that, you know, ultimately we are a, we are a people business. Um, it's our output, it's our intellectual property that is what our clients are paying for us. So you do find that the culture really invests in that, um, spends time nurturing, um, spends time giving you the opportunities to, to do new things. So we, we do a huge amount in the, the CSR space and, and kind of we've just had our one day for change where you go and spend a day volunteering. I'm very actively involved in DEI as well and, and how we support people who come from different backgrounds. Um, and I feel that Dentsu really is leading the way in the advertising and in the media agency space for that, especially we're definitely the number one agency for supporting people on their journeys. And you feel that in our culture, you feel very, you feel like it's an inclusive place to work. You feel like it's a fun place to work, but also you're kind of progressing as a person whilst you're here as well. Just enjoy it. Like, um, it is hard work. You do have to put in the hours, you have to do things sometimes that make you feel a little bit uncomfortable. Um, this afternoon I've got to stand up in front of the entire agency and that still makes me feel uncomfortable. But if you enjoy it, if you feel like you're getting something out of every day, then you will progress and you will kind of come through and you will find the role that works for you. There's nothing wrong with coming into an agency of this size and doing one role when you kind of come in as a, as a grad and then kind of seeing what some of the other people are doing and there's always an opportunity to move around as well.